Good morning, y'all. That was my little stretch. <laughs> and welcome back to my channel. Today, I decided to record another What I Eat in a Day because I really like doing these. And I also have to get some groceries. So we're gonna do a little grocery haul. And then I am meeting up with one of my friends for like a little wind down Wednesday situation. And so I'm gonna take you guys along with me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment, let me know what you think, but I'm so excited that you're here and thanks for watching. For breakfast, I am having the TikTok viral pesto eggs, vegan of course, and I'm using the liquid just egg as well as some vegan pesto that I picked up at TJ Maxx in like their little grocery section. Um, and this was actually really, really good. I think the next time I'm going to use like a homemade pesto because there was probably just like a little too much oil in the store bought one, which I wasn't a huge fan of. But anyway, I had that with some Dave's Killer Bread. Um, it was the blueberry bagel, I believe, which we really love, as well as some tomatoes. Y'all, I feel like I'm always eating tomatoes, but as well as some tomatoes and I sprinkled some everything bagel seasoning on top. And for lunch, I'm having tofu spring rolls. Y'all, these spring rolls are so freaking good. And also because it's super hot outside, I don't feel like doing too much cooking and like heating up our kitchen because y'all, it gets so hot in my house, it's actually really crazy. So for my tofu, this is just my traditional method where I freeze my tofu, I thaw it out, and then I cut it up. I toss it in olive oil, coconut aminos, as well as some cornstarch, and I'm gonna throw it in the air fryer. So I'm filling these spring rolls with some red bell peppers, some cucumber, I have avocado, lettuce, as well as some carrots. So I just wet the rice paper in like warm water until it was like flimsy. Not like too flimsy, but like just right. To the point where I can actually like fold it and it'll be easy to put together. Y'all, rolling these is such a struggle for me. I've had these so many times and like every single time, at least like two of the rice paper rolls ends up breaking or ripping on me. So if you have any tips or suggestions, please let me know. <laughs> and here's my chlorophyll water. Y'all, I'm still going strong with my water, okay? I am being consistent. I'm so proud of myself. But anyway, so I had these spring rolls with some sweet chili sauce initially, but I ended up going back and swapping that out and I made a peanut dipping sauce, which just had peanut butter, some sriracha, rice vinegar, water, as well as a little bit of brown sugar. Okay, and I didn't feel like leaving the house, so I had groceries delivered from a place called Natural Grocers. So I got like spinach, I got white rice, and a variety of vegetables. Oh yeah, here's some chia seeds as well. And some spinach tortillas for wraps and everything. These are 100% vegan. So if you see them, grab them, cause I do like them. I also got some frozen broccoli. And some sourdough bread. This is completely vegan, but I love to use sourdough bread for my French toast, which I'll have to record myself making the French toast next time because y'all, it is so bomb. I got some tofu and I only buy firm or extra firm tofu. And so that's all for box one. Box two, I got a bunch of different vegetables. One thing I will say is that I do, I like going to the grocery store myself sometimes because I don't put my vegetables or fruits and things like that in those individual bags as much as this delivering company did. Um, that's probably something I'll have to mention the next time I order is like, hey, try not to use so much plastic. I don't need all of that. Like it honestly just created additional waste for me, which was clearly not needed. Like <laughs> they put literally one individual thing in each bag, which was kind of crazy to me. But anyway, I got a bunch of different vegetables. So I had like onions, tomatoes, had the, the cucumber, 
I also got some mushroom as you see right there um, it was just a variety of oh, avocado as well just a bunch of different veggies to keep my fridge stocked so that I can prep some meals for the week and the weekend So where we ended up going for happy hour, they don't have a lot of vegan options on their menu. So I made sure to cook some food before I went and I decided to make myself a tofu poke bowl, which I've recorded this entire video on like how to do it in a previous video. I'll link that in the description box. So if you want the details, you can go check it out. But it's essentially just white rice. I have some tofu that I marinated in a sauce as well as some carrots. I have some purple cabbage, some green onions, some avocado, as well as some seaweed. And then I mix together some vegan mayo as well as sriracha sauce for like a spicy mayo. And then you saw me drizzle some sesame seed oil and sprinkle on some black sesame seeds and this was dinner. So we ended up ordering like a, it was kind of like a lemon drop, which was, okay, really good. I think when I, when I say that I don't like martinis, it's like those dirty martinis because they are so strong. So that was stop number one. And then we went over to a place called The Vault, which has like super cute drinks. Like I love going there. This little drink is so freaking good. I get it every time I come here. Mm. So good. And that was my Wednesday. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Make sure you're subscribed to my channel and I will see you next week.